$600 million. That's the bet FIFA is placing on the newly elected president, Gianni Infantino. The money is in jeopardy of being lost after reports emerged of top sponsors holding out on deals ahead of the 2018 World Cup in Russia. CCTV's Dan Williams spoke with the new president in Zurich and reports he's preparing new reforms for FIFA. Excitement and disbelief for Gianni Infantino still as he comes to term with becoming the president of FIFA just some 24 hours or so after he was elected as the new FIFA president. Uh, uh, but on top of that, there's also a realisation of the tough job that now lies ahead for him. Of course, FIFA's reputation is in tatters after a string of controversies and it's going to be under his watch to make sure that uh, to try and rebuild that reputation and to move on from the uh, various uh, allegations and controversies that FIFA has faced over the last nine months or so. Well, that is a task, definitely. I mean, uh, I was also part of the reform committee of FIFA, so I know exactly what is needed, I know exactly what has to be done, I know exactly when it has to be done, it has to be done as of today. So we will implement the reforms and uh, the new era has uh, started and I'm sure that the image and reputation of FIFA will come up very, very quickly. Well, it may well take more than just those reforms in order to regain the confidence of the general public, of course. Uh, there's a big task ahead as well. There's a huge hole in FIFA's finances, and it's up to Gianni Infantino to bring on the new sponsors to make, to start making some deals and to start bringing the money through FIFA. But of course, there's still a long way to go uh, in that process as well. Uh, it also, Infantino got the backing today of Sepp Blatter as well. The former president, the man that he's taken over uh, from as well, says that Infantino is the right man for the job. He's the, uh, got the energy and has the, the right credentials, if you like, to take FIFA forward. There was also a word of warning as well, saying that uh, Infantino will find himself under greater scrutiny as well in this job. Uh, but of course, how much, uh, of course, the question is how much that uh, Infantino will want that kind of uh, backing, of course, from Sepp Blatter, who, of course, has been mired in controversy uh, himself. Uh, but certainly, uh, it's a step in the right direction for Infantino. He's uh, got the big job ahead of him. And on Monday, uh, here at uh, FIFA's home of football, he'll take part in a football match. Uh, certainly, what he's looking to do is to show that uh, football is all about making uh, headlines on the pitch, not off it. Dan Williams, CCTV, Zurich.